The Milwaukee Admirals will have a new home next season. They're leaving the BMO Harris Bradley Center after 28 years. Jonah Kaplan live tonight with that story, Jonah. Well, Steve, they're moving across the state, State Street, that is, here to the UW Panther Arena. The team making this move, leaving the Brad Bradley Center, they're saying they're not going to wait for the new Bucks Arena. And the team, well, it's just fine with that decision. Roscoe has a new home, even if he doesn't have a new key. All those in favor of approving the uh, new license agreement with the Admiral signify by saying aye. Aye. The Wisconsin Center District today unanimously voted to accept the Milwaukee Admirals move across State Street. They've skated at the Bradley Center since it was built in 1988. Oh, this is more of a family event versus, you know, an event that's out of their cost. The six-block Wisconsin Center District generates some revenue from events at the Convention Center, UW Panther Arena, and Milwaukee Theater. Most of its income, though, comes from visitors renting cars and staying in hotels in Milwaukee County. The Admirals will pay $2 million to help facilitate the move. The district will also invest in new equipment, locker rooms, and concourses. I think the long-term future for the team has never been brighter. The CEO sales pitch is a more intimate experience, and it makes sense. The Admirals now average 5,800 fans a game. In their history, they've attracted anywhere from 4,000 to nearly 10,000 fans. At the Bradley Center, that's a half-empty arena. At the Panther Arena, it's closer to capacity. I think we actually have seen that over the years when with Miller Park. County Stadium actually held more people, but Miller Park's smaller. It created a, a more intimate environment. Now the last home game for the Admirals to lace up at the Bradley Center, that will be April 15th. Coming up tonight at 6, what does this move mean to the Bucks? And we have a big update on the new Bucks Arena. We're live here downtown this afternoon. Jonah Kaplan, today's TMJ4. All right, Jonah, thank you.